they aren't obviously they're just gonna feed us a whole bunch of bullshit um as far as you know they're gonna say oh it's not happening and you've got to prove it and even though like i've got i've got over i don't know about 20 different water tests rainwater blood analysis hair analysis tests um, from all different parts of new zealand um, showing high levels of barium strontium and aluminium and uh, I mean they're, they're just the three basic um, components that they put in into their chemtrail mixes depending on the agenda what they're doing um, depends on what goes into the chemtrails you know so um, if they're doing a drought you know or you know it's usually barium because they want to dry up the atmosphere um, so they, they hit it hard with that obviously they're using graphene oxide now which has been found um, and documented um, so there's no escaping the the graphene oxide at all you know um, we're all breathing it in it's all creating new circuitry within our bodies you know um, this is how they're hooking us up to the uh, to the internet of things you know that's us that's us this is how they're cooking us into the smart grid and without the geoengineering their control plan doesn't work that's why it's so such a that's why they're hammering me and targeting me big time trying to put me off because you know this is the backbone to their, their control plan you know the geoengineering and the not necessarily the weather modification but it's more the the fact that they've ionized they are ionizing the atmosphere you'll notice places like england and america they're just hard out with their um with their chemtrailing and a lot of that is it's for the military use because there's a civilian side and a military side to the chemtrails you know so they're war ready they're ready to use that if they want to create some sort of event like you know an earthquake for example you know because they are, that are that is their weapons now these are their weapons you know tectonic weaponry and they need the chemtrails they need the geoengineering for that so that's why a lot of these places like you see in the states are just so hammered is that they're ready to go